Well guys, here we are finishing off the last bit of 50 million hunter at least for now. I believe I have a few more to catch. Let me see. Uh, yeah, this one right here. Sweet. Would have been nice if I got the pet right there. Just like a nice little trigger. But anyways, there it is. 50 million hunter experience. Been hunting a decent amount for the past uh, week or so. But probably continue at it. As far as how many tortoises I've caught, I will show you guys quickly. Tort. Uh, combining. 17, 8, it's almost 18,000, not too bad. <laughs> that was the last <laughs> How are you doing? <laughs> What are you talking about? We're, we're yeah, leaving. I, I gotta go do my dailies. Because, like, I just, it's Because you two were luck, right? Bullshit! Like they're fucking bias in this game. They give people like things so they can make video content about it. Are you gonna put good that in the video? Oh yeah, I am. I just put you oh, in the video. Are you vidding? No. Vidding? Were you vidding? Yes. Oh my god. Don't worry. I'm not gonna put your commentary in there. Yes. I needed that. I needed that. Yes. Ah. <sighs> Oh my god, this day doesn't get any better. <laughs> yes! This day doesn't... That was so unexpected. I just saw sparks. I thought I got like a virtual farming level, but no. Oh man, 60 million farming XP basically. Sweet! Oh my goodness. That is awesome. That is fucking awesome. Anyways, I'm gonna make some fishing urns since I've been doing a little bit of the fishing in the arc and you can use fishing urns like I said, so I have to make more of these things. Um, one thing I want to quickly mention is, as much as you might think I'm extremely lucky on pets, I'm, I think I'm honestly just average, maybe even below. Keep in mind, I don't have a hunter pet yet, down about 30 something mil XP. And I also don't have the herb pet, which I did like 35 mil XP, which... Uh, that 35 mil XP on Iron Man was extremely long to even get that because obviously you gotta collect the supplies as well, but, um, and you know, cleaning the herbs and blah, 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 which even gives it another pet chance. So um, I've cleaned like 70,000 herbs or some shit without any pets there. On top of that, I did 35 mil XP with just making potions. So I'm, I'm due at this point a herb pet as well and then hunter pet hopefully soon, but um, nice to see finally getting the farming one. I think farming one also does matter on herb runs. I think that also counts as picks. Um, I've done maybe like 500k XP at the Ark as well. Uh, just collecting the mushrooms and stuff. I should be using my pack yak here for this, but uh, I'm about to go to bed anyways. This was like, a, I just felt like doing a Raxer tonight before bed and I get a freaking bottom and then all of a sudden I get a farm pet as I'm going to bed uh, as my farm run. Anyways, here's the chat box on my uh, newbie account so you guys can see. So uh, 6.55 in the morning, I got that. And then at 7.30 in the morning, I get the farming pet. So, pretty sweet, yeah. Nice, like, yeah. As far as my newbie account goes, 100 and almost 45 mil div. Fuck that, though. Much more AFK to go. Oh, my goodness. There it is. The hunter pets. The motherfucking hunter pets. So, uh, just about 99% of this is ever since the pets have come out. So 22.7 thousand of these and I get the hunter pets. So nice. Anyways, that was roughly 40 million hunter for that pet. So it's not too bad. Um, I'm kind of in a dilemma right now. I'm considering maybe just going for all uh, skilling pets on my Iron Man account. By the way, ignore the armor you're about to see me having on. I'm about to take it off, but I unlocked this set, the Ark. It's like 5,000 points. It's like Tatsu with like some weird shit around it, but I'm taking it off. I just wanted to see what it was. It's like 5,000 chimes and I had some to spare. But anyway, let's go to my pets quickly and show you guys. I'm on farming potion, so I can't talk too much, but yeah, these are basically all the pets I have at the moment. Seven of them, I believe. And I believe I am 16 million mining dry of a pet and like 30 something mil herb. I think that's mostly all I've done 
for skilling that I haven't gotten the pets for, I believe, or something like that. So um, I kind of wish I didn't get lucky on something like a fishing and a woodcutting pet, because I would definitely get those eventually. Ooh, sweet. Um, but uh, something like herb lore or even like construction might be really annoying on an Iron Man because you got to collect so much shit. Anyways, pretty soon I will be probably making like 13,000 super attack potions on this account, so I guess that will be something. Uh, I doubt I'll get the pet there, it's like 1.3 mil XP, but if I do get it, then it's sweet. But yeah, I still want to go for the pets, and on top of that, I kind of want to just get 200 mil Hunter, to be honest. I'm not really too sure why, I just I don't really mind doing it. And Hunter kind of became a daily ever since the art came out, but you can kind of bypass doing it as a daily. You're not going to have as many chimes at the ending of it. Uh, so if I did 200 mil hunter as like a daily, I'd have a lot of chimes at the ending. If I do it the way I'm currently doing, I'm not going to have that many left because I'm kind of just surviving off of what I'm hunting uh, in terms of like going to other uncharted islands. Um, but uh, I don't know. I mean, like there's still some pretty good hunt ranks left. I don't really know as long as I get top 10, right? It's kind of cool. And I think I'm pretty close to like top 15 so far. So um, that's sort of what I've also been doing, obviously, as you guys probably tell. Uh, I think I started doing the arc at like 18 million Hunter XP, so done quite a bit. And on top of that, I have been going back to PVM a tiny bit. I did a bit of Indicta, and I did a little bit of, uh, what is it called, Araxor. I still haven't gotten anything else from the Araxor, but uh, I did pass 1200 KC, I believe, today, which is not too bad. I think uh, my drop rate for Spider Legs is 1 in 48, in case you guys are wondering. I am not that dry of a spider that I think I got one like 60 or 70 KC ago, so um, I guess technically according to my drop rate, that's kind of dry almost, but um, I've got like 300 dry on a, on a leg. Why the hell can I click this? Fucking hell. Um, anyways, I'll see you guys in a bit. I'm going to finish off my herb run. I moved on to quorums now. I still have like 1,000 irate seeds and I have like 13,000 clean ones or grimy ones at least, but um, I'm going to probably switch over and work on these for now and then I'll eventually work on all the other ones that I need. White berries is at like 2,000 roughly, just from doing them during my herb run, so that's not too bad. Uh, hopefully by the time next year comes, whenever we have the um, uh, the beach event again, I'll have a whole bunch of potions that I can make. Um, the cooking pet is also something I've been slowly working on. I've cooked, uh, I think, 35 to 40,000 lobsters, and I cooked all my like rock tails and that stuff. So I have still 10,000 raw of that, 1.5k raw of that. And uh, whenever I was playing some old school, I just AFK'd some shark fishing, so I got some of these as well. But yeah, it's all the raw food. I, I guess I have these. I did some of that from the kingdom, but uh, I'll probably cook all these and just see what it gets me. I mean, I don't know if I'll get the pet, but uh, I don't know. I mean, at least it's cooking XP for right now. Anyways, PVM-wise, I did get myself two Zeros uh, crests, so um, I'm basically just waiting until I get the plate body now. I only have the dormant legs. I have one more dormant leg. I'll probably use something on. Um, I think I have the Siren one here as well, which is the Mage, so I uh, don't know if I want to use that though, but um, yeah, so yeah, that's kind of a nice set to have, I mean tier 80 top and bottom that don't degrade uh, once I get the Dormant top, which I actually missed because my friend sniped it rip. Alright, I guess this is like an update to my PVM tab, which hasn't really changed because obviously I've been skilling for the past long ass time, but uh, yeah, not much has changed. I love the U-Logs, man, it looks beautiful having over 100,000 of them. Uh, probably use these on fire making for the pet eventually in the future, so, um, yep. Anyways, let's do a little bit of a Raxer. Now I think I'm like 100% in rage. Overload. There it is. I still haven't switched my armor. Rip. Uh, and rage is 100, so let's do like, I don't know, three or four kills probably. Let's go. Absolute garbage. Damn. Amazing. Just amazing. And the last drop. Yeah. I really do wonder when I'm going to get my base pet from Arax, or it's getting a little bit depressed. I don't really care too much, but it's just getting a little bit kind of annoying. How's it going, guys? Welcome back to a bit of, I don't even know what this is, I guess a little bit of PVM. Um, as you guys, I've been doing this little bit duo, but uh, the last time I tried this solo, I was like not really in good gear, like malevolent, and I used a butt ton of food. So I thought maybe I wouldn't even bother ever soloing this thing, but uh, ever since the Malevolent upgrade and as well as the uh, Vamp Blood, um, yeah, it's very easy to solo. I think I last like 45 minutes solo here, uh, but that's, I mean, that's not too great, I guess, but it's whatever. I think I'm killing about 2.5 every overload dose or something, so uh, I'm fine with that. I think uh, do du or duo with like my partners, at least, it was not too much faster than that. So all the drops are now mine. And it would have been sweet if we just got a Lancer, but uh, what the 
fuck is this? Why is there a magic seed there? What? RDT from this boss? I've never gotten an RDT from a boss, but sweet! That is amazing. That's a very good drop. But yeah, obviously I'm just trying to get the lance here. The lance is like the last part of my... I think it's max DPS. I'm not too sure. Uh, in terms of uh, my... my uh, da -da 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 -da, what's it called? Perks. There we go. So my perks will basically be max DPS now once I do get this last bit of something. Because uh, biting three and all that crap is on there. Anyways, current KC at the moment. Let's have a look. I believe it's a little bit over 400 maybe now. Um, Vindicta, regular mode. Yeah, 429, so it's not too bad. Uh, I mean, I guess. Though if I do get the uh, dormant top, then I can actually have the top and bottom uh, tier 80, which is sweet, so that is something to look forward to. I could probably use the top uh, at like a bunch of different places, and I guess legs as well for Slayer, so Slayer upgrade will be amazing. I don't have to go to next, I guess, which is nice, but still will go there in the future, just not right now, because, yeah, fuck that. All right, and I also did some rots tonight, and I finished my rot shield set. I got the malevolent shield, which is the last one I need, and I actually have two of the other shields, so I just need one more malevolent shield, I guess, and I will have a... Uh, two sets of rot shields which I don't know if I'll use anytime soon because I'm not really doing too much PVMing but maybe in the future I'll do more PVMing or just return to it I guess. Where's my rot trail sign? Here we go. Anyways I will see you guys in a bit. All kinds of games. Wish me luck on the lanes. Let's go. And time to do another full hour. This is gonna be great. Well there's a drop. Not really anything. Oh, yeah. Fuck.